Hey everyone, hey mermaids. Welcome to my channel. I'm Tracy and my channel is Tracy from the Mermaid Co. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you like and subscribe, hit the bell, comment, comment. I love comments. So it's most appreciated. Namaste. And I'm here with Trader Joe's, a little Trader Joe's, which is still 60 bucks. So uh, yeah, they, um, my freezer's full. So not totally full, but full enough that I need to eat some of that down and do some taste tests. But I got, um, I love this unexpected broccoli cheddar soup. It's so good and it's so easy to eat. Um, it looks like a different color though. You probably can't see it. It's a little pinkier. I don't know. I don't know why would it be pinkier? Hmm. Got to the end of March anyway. It's usually good two meals. Now, taste test. This, I think they said, won the award. I couldn't tell. There was two there, but it felt like this one. So this is Cotswold. Love Cotswold. Love reading about mysteries in Cotswold. Double gloss sheer. So I have no idea with onions and chives. I'm bad about getting cheese and then not eating it. So I am going to incorporate some cheese and crackers in my life. So, that's good. And get a wedge. Very good, but I'm not sure what it reminds me of. Maybe a little bit of bourgeon that has a shallot. Very good. So I tried to find the smallest one because I mean, I would like to have half of that really, but they don't do that. Yes, liquid sunshine. I'm trying not to drink calories, but that is got to be better than having soda, right? And this I've done a taste test on. I couldn't remember where I got it. thought it was Trader Joe's, but it's La Colombia Coffee Draft Latte Oat Milk. I love it. It's not, it's smooth. It's not super strong, but it just really, I had one in the car yesterday coming home because I was hungry. Anyway, it's like a, under, it's like, $1.79, so I, I really, I love it. One of the main reasons I ran in was to get my French roast coffee, not that when you see my coffee thing that I don't have enough coffee, but I love that coffee. And how much is that coffee? Spend $69. Um, Oh, this was actually two seventy nine. Tangerine juice is three twenty nine. And you know, nothing is like over five bucks, right? The coffee is four ninety nine. These are good. I'm gonna try to freeze them. So I'll have one when I want one. Am I gonna? I'm going to use my seal vac this weekend. I'm going to teach myself how to use it. But there's a video, my so she thinks I will be quite capable. And I threw out my balsamic. So I got this Ascento Balsamic de Modena. I like it. It was smaller. I was weak. There's a new... Um, Cinnamon, raisin, I guess cinnamon bread. I don't like raisins and I saw this. <sighs> anyway, um, this I couldn't find the last couple times. So Trader Joe's breaded fried ravioli. Now the one I, my uh, local like pizza place called Lito's has their spicy though. And they're so good dipped in marinara, but I'm gonna try them. So this time I was looking for those mini baguettes, didn't have them. So that's what happens. You know, you're probably not gonna find it right away, but something like that, you know, they're gonna have. All right. Are garbanzo beans the same as chickpeas? This is my question. <clears throat> I wanna do this air fry chickpeas with sweet chili thing on it. I found in a cookbook, sweet chili seasoning sauce. Anyway, is garbanzo bean a chickpea? These are the questions I need to know. I feel like they are inner source of, I, I don't know. How could they be that much different? I don't know. Probably are, but. Okay. 
new crispy peanut butter filled milk chocolate peanuts. Look at that packaging. So I'll try this. See what I'm not, you know, peanut butter is not my thing. I mean, I like peanut butter. Oh, how cute. Look at that. Look at a little peanut. I mean, it's good. Am I gonna buy them again? Probably not. Just because peanut butter's not my thing. But yeah, that's really good. No, I really didn't get that much, so. These are amped up almonds, chocolate coated almonds. So it has 16 grams of protein in this bag. I'm not sure how they amp it up. Confectioner shellac. Shot. See? I'm training myself not to use my teeth. I'll share these with my friend. She loves almonds. Oh, it looks, just looks like a normal almond. Um, it's not super sweet. I mean, okay. I mean, almonds aren't my thing. She'll look, probably like them, but that's amazing. 16 grams of protein. Okay, new two. Hawaiian macadamia nut blossom and multi-floral honey. I got rid of a couple honeys. Let me... Oh, I had my spoon from this nasty yogurt. I'm gonna go with that spoon. Is good. I have to wipe that off it. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna that a ton. Now I'm not a honey connoisseur. I go through stages, but that is good. And I got this to try: protein bar, cookies and cream, barbells, two 20 grams of protein, no added sugar. It's probably terrible. I'm not gonna try it right now. And I'm gonna try this because I'm gonna give it to my friend. Trader Joe's organic sea salt, sea sea salt. A mermaid should be able to say sea salt and nibs dark chocolate. Simple origin heirloom cocoa beans from Madagascar, dairy free. Okay, so Madagascar producer some of the world's finest chocolate. All right, I love the packaging. Look at that, the little lemur hiding. It's adorable. They are on with the pack with the, so I don't know what to tell you guys. The packaging. And you come in here. So what are you looking forward to to trying at Trader Joe's? I don't, honestly, I just give up about all that. I'm trying to look like a normal grown up. Okay. They come in little. Get a hint of the salt. You can feel the nubs. Um, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's just a little bitter. Yeah, they will be going to my friend. She'll probably love it. Smooth, kind of. It has that interesting stuff in it, but yeah. You think I'll ever grow up and like that kind of chocolate? I guess I'd have to be on sugar for a long time that that would taste good. Okay, I tried it. Yeah. Um, I hate to give it a bad review because I'm sure it's good for what it is. I mean, Trader Joe's is the best, right? And these are heirloom cocoa beans. So I'm sure for a lot of people, this would be eight or nine. For me and my taste buds and being like a sugar addict, hopefully in recovery soon. Uh, yeah, not, I'm, I'll give it a two. I mean, just based on my taste buds and, you know, but they're heirloom. I'm sure my friend's gonna love it. She loves stuff like this. So anyway, 
Nothing if not honest, right? Okay, so that was it. I mean, honestly, I gotta eat down. Maybe I'll just pull stuff out of my freezer. Like, look what I got this time. But yeah, I'm gonna do, uh, I, they did have a new pizza. Oh, I just forgot, I did get one other thing. So I love the, um, the Greer cheese one of this brand. And they have one with mushrooms, it's taste brie and tomatoes, a very French thin crust with brie, cheese and tomatoes. I love the other one and I made it yesterday. I will try this and I'm sure it's good, but the other one is my favorite. Like the mushrooms are okay, but always gravitate. But you know, I'm all about trying. But the thin crust on these, and honestly, you can eat the whole thing at 600 calories. I usually eat half, try to add a salad, then eat the rest of mine at lunch today. So yeah, anyway, if you guys haven't tried these yet, try them. I mean, do the caramelized onion one first. It's just, I mean, maybe I'll love this one as much. I don't know. Okay. Ramblin. It's a nice sunny day here. I feel like we survive winter, even if it's another day or two of yuckiness. We're coming up to spring. Thank you. But anyway, guys, I appreciate it. Your comments, your likes, all that. I will see you soon.